Howdy folks, welcome back. Happy Monday, Thursday. Um, so I have an original song for you guys here. And before we do that, I just want to quick read a little little bit here. Um, so this is found in Gospel of John, um, chapter 13. Um, yeah, starting in verse 1 here. Um, now before the feast of Passover, when Jesus knew that his hour had come to depart out of this world to the Father, having loved his own who were, who were in the world, he loved them to the end. During supper, when the devil had already put into the heart of Judas Iscariot, Simon's son, to betray him, Jesus, knowing that the Father had given all things into his hands, and that he had come from God and was going back to God, rose from the supper. He laid aside his outer garments, and taking a towel, tied it around his waist. Then he poured water into a basin and began to wash the disciples' feet and to wipe them with a the towel that was wrapped around him. He came to Simon Peter, who said to him, Lord, do you wash my feet? Jesus answered him, what I am doing now, you do not understand, but afterward you will understand. Peter said to him, You shall never wash my feet. Jesus answered him, If I do not wash you, you have no share with me. Simon Peter said to him, Lord, not my feet only, but also my hands and my head. Jesus said to him, The one who has bathed does not need to wash except for his feet, but is completely clean, and you are clean, but not every one of you. For he knew who he was to betray him. That was why he said, Not all of you are clean. When he had washed their feet and put on his outer garments and resumed his place, he said to them, Do you understand what I have done to you? You call me teacher and Lord, and you are right, for so I am. If I then, your teacher and Lord, have washed your feet, you also ought to wash one another's feet. For I have given you an example that you should do just as I have done to you. Truly, truly, I say to you, a servant is not greater than his master, nor is a messenger greater than the one who sent him. If you knew these things, blessed are you if you do them. I am not speaking of all of you. I know whom I have chosen, but the scripture will be fulfilled. He who ate my bread has lifted his heel against me. I am telling you this now, before it takes place, that when it does take place, you may believe that I am he. Truly, truly, I say to you, whoever receives the one I send receives me, and whoever receives me receives the one who sent me. Um, so yeah, so I just wanted to read that quickly, just to kind of preface um, this song. So with no further ado, um, let's just go ahead and get to the music here. <clears throat> Wash the traitor's feet, he commanded us to do as well. He emptied himself and bore God's wrath to save our souls from hell. He told us, Love our enemies, for we're enemies of God. But now we're no longer enemies, for he bought us with Christ's blood. Yeah, we're no longer enemies when we believe the Son of God. It was the final supper of Jesus and his crew. He got up from the table, and what do you think he would do? He laid aside his garments, got a towel and some water, and he proceeded to wash the feet of each disciple that was there. Yeah, Jesus washed the traitor's feet, he commanded us to do as well. He emptied himself and bore God's wrath to save our souls from hell. He told us to love our enemies, for we're enemies of God. Now we're no longer enemies, for he bought us with Christ's blood. Yeah, we're no longer enemies, we believe the Son of God. The disciples, they were all shocked, they didn't know just what to do. And Jesus told them, do unto others what you've just seen me do to you. For you call me Lord and Master, and that is rightly so. And now I've shown you how to serve, and I'm commanding you to go. Washed the traitor's feet, he commanded us to do as well. He emptied himself and bore God's wrath to save our souls from hell. He told us to love our enemies, for we're enemies of God. But now we're no longer enemies, for he bought us with Christ's blood. Yeah, we're no longer enemies, we believe the Son of God. Now, what does this have to tell us in this age of overwhelming pride? I think part of what Jesus is saying is lay arrogant thoughts aside. For we are called to be servants to our brothers and sisters under God. For no greater joy will ever be found in serving in the kingdom of God. Jesus walked the traitor's feet, he commanded us to do as well. He emptied himself and bore God's wrath to save our souls from hell. He told us to love our enemies, for we are enemies of God. Now we're no longer enemies, for he bought us with Christ's blood. Yeah, we're no longer enemies, we believe the Son of God. Yeah, Jesus wants to trade us, he commanded us to do as well. He emptied himself and 
boy got trapped to say our souls now Told us love our enemies for enemies of God Now we're no longer enemies, we're lost with Christ's blood Yeah, we're no longer enemies, we believe The Son of God There you go. Happy Monday, Thursday, everybody. Take care. Lord willing, I'll see you guys Easter Monday with an Easter song for y'all. God bless you. Keep your stick on the ice. Take care.